Hello guys, the Rusty Hubcap here and back with another video and uh, well today I went looking hubcaps today because today is the very last hubcap search for 2017 and uh, ready to bring on a new year for uh, hubcaps in 2018. So I'm going to go ahead and start with uh, the findings for New Year's Eve. First find is this aftermarket hubcap which is still wet from where it was nearby some sprinklers found in front of a sheets gas station it's a brand new kt321 16 inch aftermarket so you can see it's made in 2017 in september so it's only four months old and uh already fell off it's got all of its clips and the ring and uh in very nice condition definitely worth keeping Next is the 2010 to 2013 Cadillac Escalade center cap with the chrome emblem. They made the color emblem as well on the back. Uh, all the clips are in good shape except for this one. It's bent forward and uh, let's see, there was this clip, clip that was bent backwards and it's made by FPE, which is another pretty nice find. I did make a video of me finding this one. So if that video is uploaded by the time this one is, go check that one out if you can. Next find is this unfortunately broken, but it's a uh, very rare 2003 to 2005 Cadillac DeVille Snowflake center cap. It's missing a couple little plastic tabs, and all of these are about to snap off. So I better uh, keep an eye out on this one, make sure it doesn't break any further, because these are very, very hard to find. And uh, this is a 2004 made by Olay Plastics. Same company that makes most Chevrolet and Cadillac hubcaps and a few Pontiacs. This is the very last find of 2017. Found it just a few minutes ago, if not an hour ago. It was a 1997 to 2003 Ford F-150 Expedition. And it's got uh, a part number here. Drawn on the back with a Sharpie. Apparently this was apparently a buy at a salvage yard or... A factory replacement because uh, as you may know nobody ever did this at the Ford factory and drew on the center caps most of the times this metal plating back here is missing but this one is intact this was a local find and this is the chrome and silver version which are more harder to find than the other ones next is a gas cap from a Freightliner it's from a 2013 Freightliner um, uh, I can't remember the name of this one. I think it's Cascadian. I think it's a Freightliner Cascadian. And on it says diesel fuel, push and turn, apparently to open it. And there's where the tab is where you have to grab onto it. And there used to be a chain back here, but it's not there anymore. And if I believe correctly, this was found where I believe a semi truck had crashed into the woods somewhere. And I'm not sure if this was a part of it or it just was a coincidence that it fell off right in front of the crash site. But it says uh, there's the part number and uh, there's the rubber backing. And it's in pretty good condition and it's pretty heavy. It's made of metal. Uh, definitely a nice thing. And this is uh, very unusual. I'm not sure if this is a hubcap. I'm, I got doubts. I'm pretty sure it's not. But it was found up against the curb laying face down. Well, laying face down, propped up against the curb, like it was a hubcap, but it's 13 inch, and it's made of metal. And uh, if anybody out there knows exactly what kind of thing this is, please leave it in the comment section. It's got all three of its little tabs back here are bent, and it's got one rusted screw left, and it's actually got clips on the outer edge. I'm not sure if this is a burner from some kind of stove or a something from some antique washing machine or a trash can lid or something like that i'm not quite sure what it is but it was actually found near the kt aftermarket that i showed at the very beginning of the video it's found right near it so uh if anybody knows what this is please uh, let me know in the comment section if it's a hubcap most certainly keep it and if it is a hubcap please tell me what kind but if it's not a hubcap and it's something else i might just I don't know, take it to the scrap yard for some scrap money. I'm not sure. But uh, that's all the finds for 2017 there. That's a pretty good conclusion. And I'm going back out for more hubcaps, hopefully tomorrow. 
to hopefully ring in a new year for our hubcap collecting. And uh, that's it for, t for this evening, and uh, have a good New Year's. Bye.